What's up guys, Aaron here, back with another video. In today's video, I'm gonna be telling you how to update your Apple Watch's watch OS software. Welcome back and let's go ahead and get right into it. Now before you actually start the update process, there's a couple things that you need to do first. First off, you need to make sure that the iPhone that your Apple Watch is connected to is running iOS 9 or higher. Next, you need to make sure that your iPhone and your Apple Watch are in range of each other. You also need to make sure that your Apple Watch has at least a 50% charge. And lastly, you need to make sure that it's connected to the charger. You can go ahead and download the new Watch OS 2 software on your Apple Watch with less than 50% battery life. However, you won't be able to install it until the Apple Watch has over 50% charge. And you also see an installation paused menu. Now that you've completed the preparations for Watch OS 2, let's go ahead and begin the actual installation. The first thing you need to do is open up your Apple Watch application on your iPhone and select the My Watch tab. Tap General and then tap Software Update. Tap Download and Install to begin the process. You're going to need to enter your four digit passcode when prompted on the Apple Watch. Next, the Apple logo and progress bar will appear while the software is installing. And once it's all complete, the Apple Watch will restart. Now, for some reason, if something goes wrong and the device freezes or you weren't able to properly install the software, all you have to do is simply restart the device. And to do so, hold down the side button until the power off slider appears. Then slide the bar to shut off the Apple Watch. Then hold down the side button until the Apple Watch logo appears. Then wait for the Apple Watch to restart. Then simply enter your passcode when prompted. Now, if worse comes to worse and powering down your Apple Watch doesn't fix the problem, then you can also try a hard reset, which is going to force the device to completely shut off. Now, this is going to take a bit longer to restart the Apple Watch once you've done so. To perform a hard reset, hold down the side button and the digital crown at the same time. The screen will go blank and then the Apple logo will appear. Then wait for the Apple Watch to restart and lastly enter your passcode when prompted. Now, in case you're wondering, I do own an Apple Watch myself and I would have physically done the update on video. However, just before making this video, I did realize that Apple had a bug to fix in their software and they're not going to release the software for a couple more hours. However, I did want to make this video to let you guys know how to update to Watch OS 2 once it is available. Anyways, guys, that's going to do it for me in this video. If this video helped you out in any way, please be sure to drop a thumbs up down below and leave a comment down in the comments section. And also, don't forget to share this video with a friend. If you have not yet subscribed to the channel, now's a great time to hit that subscribe button and you will be notified in your inbox every time I upload a new video. Don't forget to drop a like down below and leave a comment down in the comment section. I'd like to take this opportunity to thank you guys for watching. As I mentioned earlier, my name is Aaron and I'll see you guys on the next one.